Hey guys, we're back to the next video. Now, this is the review of the Master Liquid 240 Atmos from Cooler Master. Gonna take a look what it's like. Also, hear the overall sound of the fans and have a chat. So make sure you continue to watch. Okay, so this is the Master Liquid Atmos 240mm AIO at 50% fan speed. At 50%, it's barely audible. This is 100%. You can definitely hear it right now. Okay, so when it comes to my overall benchmarking, I do use a 5900X with PBO enabled. But of course, when it comes to reviews, I do try to max it out as much as possible to give you guys a good idea of what this particular AIO is capable of. Now, what I will say is that CPU at the time of each test was drawing 202 watts. For 5900X, that's quite impressive. And what I will say, no thermal throttling. So for the Cinebench R23 run, the idles are 28 Celsius with a max of 78 Celsius. Blender Classroom, the idles were 28 Celsius with a max of 76. Blender BMW, the idles are 28 Celsius with a max of 76. And 3D Mark CPU test, the idles are 28 Celsius with a max of 69 Celsius. Nice. Right then, so you've seen the overall what it looks like. You've also heard the, the fans when they're 100% fan speed. And of course, you've also heard the thermals. Now, what I will say for this AIO, it is the fastest AIO pump I've ever come across. 10,000 RPM and it is whisper silent. Honestly, it is the fastest AIO I've actually looked at. Now, the highest previously was, I believe, 6,800 RPM, and that was from uh, AIO from Be Quiet. So this thing is nuts. It's got 10,000 revolutions per minute on the pump, which is absolutely insane. It's the fastest pump I've ever checked out. I like the RGB, which... If any of you are well fan, uh, good fans of the channel, you will know I'm a big advocate for RGB and I like my RGB. I like the pump house in and what, what Cooler Master has done is this pump housing by here, they've actually released the actual design, like the, the measurements and stuff for it. So you guys can actually 3D print your own tops for the AIO which I think is actually cool and I really like the aesthetics now I do wish the fans looked like the actual pump housing which was more of a more updated version I do wish that but that's probably the only niggle I'd say the fans and the cable management was fine the cables are good length it does come with a splitter it does come with an adapter so that's actually good um when it comes to the overall performance, well, what can I really say? The 5900X in here has brought down coolers and AIOs previously. And of course, it's brought down a lot of different other coolers as well. Now, what I will say for the 5900X, it's no slouch, 202 watts on a, on a, a big CPU like this, 12 cores, 24 threads. That's a lot of power for the previous generation of Ryzen. Now, what I will say is it handled it with no problem. So if you've got a CPU between the 150 to 200 pound um, TDP rating, then this should be fine. 
It's got a very fast pump, so it is going to move a lot of the liquid into the rant very quickly. So that means the dissipation of the heat is going to really dissipate fast. That's what happens when you have a really fast pump. I do like the design and it gets my recommendation. Now I will be using this in a build as well, which will be coming very soon. So make sure you subscribe for that. And what I would like to say to Cooler Master, big thank you to them for sending out products for me to check out. Make content for you guys and also gives me something different to look at. I know I've been looking at a lot of AIOs, but obviously I haven't had a look at the AIO from Cooler Master in a very long time. Well, actually, I don't think I actually have. I think I've only looked at a case. So, yeah. <laughs> but what, what I will also say is if you guys are looking for the best microphone, this one from Newer, it's what I'm recording on now. Crystal clear sound, and it sounds amazing. And if you want to actually buy one, then the link for that would be down in the description. As a link for the Master Liquid, Atmos will be down in the description as well. And this is Richard from Welshie Tech. As always, I hope you have a fantastic week and weekend ahead of you. Good. Bye.